I'm at a gypsy. Like Coop right now would feel like I'm an independent contractor. I'm the one riding the motorcycle. You can't just replace me. Because really, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can't. You know what I mean? There's a there's yep. a finite group yep. of people that you can pick from as an elite motorcycle manufacturer that can win a Supercross championship for you. Coop's done it twice, right? Yep. So in Cooper's mind, he is this like independent contractor that has signed with this K- this team, which is KTM, and then they've got to kind of work together. To use the football analogy, greatest team combination of all time, Belichick and Brady. Do you think that Belichick was like telling Tom Brady exactly how he had to spend every minute of his time? And do you think that Tom Brady was copping that? Then especially as the seasons go on and there's more and more rings getting won, like that that relationship to me from the outside looking in if i'm belichick and i've got a fucking i've got a stud like tom brady and i'm creating a dynasty you're gonna slowly start to give that guy more and more trust right so if you're like this is me playing coop so you're cooper webb you've won two supercross championships for this team and as you get further into your career the leash gets fucking tighter around your neck. How would that feel? That would probably feel quite counterintuitive. It's like, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm winning for you and I'm doing what I got paid to do, but like, that's not, I don't think that's yeah. how the relationship should go. And then what happens? You get what fucking Eli did to, to Cowie. He just goes like, I'm out. I'm fucking leaving. And so in that sense of like, are they independent contractors? Well, yeah, because they can fucking dip. Like they can, they can leave, you know? So, but, and then that gets into this world supercross thing, right? KTM, this is to what I understand, has stopped Cooper Webb from racing three races of supercross in the off season, right? Half a million dollars. That's that's what he's losing. So, man. So, in a a sport, so this is where I'm always going to be pro rider, if I can. In a sport where you're risking your fucking life. You don't know if tomorrow's your last race. Mate, you don't know if that fucking part that they put in your new bike that you're out testing is going to grenade on you on an up ramp. Guess what? It's fucking happened and it's ruined people's lives, right? So, you want to tell me, how do you... At, like as oh, a man. human like you make have me the feel- conscience to go half oh. a million dollars you can't have it so why you, you, purely political reasons so you you make me feel old and like pol- in in very uh um politically correct with answering this because i know i know i'm that, down to hear both sides so i'm, I'm, I'm i am I am pro rider yeah but then i go i'm gonna give you why they're saying no from and leaving out if it was political or not. Yeah, okay? yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna yeah, leave yeah, out yeah, that because yeah, yeah. I, I feel there's a pretty big side of why it is hugely political. But but what they why I'll let the folks know why it's a, riders can't just dictate where my bike goes, where this goes. Yeah. Okay. So the three rounds of World Supercross are over the globe. They can't send. They're not gonna package his bike up, send it to. Um, Australia and then send it to Indo and then send it to England because they have to have a two staffers minimum go. So if, and I don't know the back, I don't know all the, the story. So is Coop willing yes. to, <laughs> to pay the whole bill for the air freight? 500, take 15. <laughs> what's that leave us so, with? So, so what's happening though is going back to contract and rider he agreed on a job mm. to do this job, right? So, yeah. Matt, you, you'd agree on jobs. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then all of a sudden, the 11th hour, there's like, man, this I can squeeze this other job in, but it's at risk. I might not finish your job for you. Mm. Okay, so he's like, I signed up to win 2023 Supercross. You've actually let me have an outdoor-only contract. Shit, I can do this other job and make a half a million dollars but it's a partnership and it's a contract that they're supposed to use him to win. They're like, yeah, yeah, you're out because if something happens to our business or we lose you, 
you've compromised our investment. Mm. So screw you. Like, I'm not saying they shouldn't let him ride. I'm not saying it's not right for the sport, but I'm going to back KTM going, no, you did your deal before this came up. Mm. I don't care if it's a million bucks or we're looking out for our best interest, our investment. You've, this is, this is, you could have done a six month deal with us, but you didn't want a six month deal. You could have done a one year deal, but you wanted a two year deal. Mm. This came in the middle of our two year deal. Mm. And now you're saying, I don't care. You agreed on a job. Like, you agreed on a job. Like, mm. you, you signed the deal to make $2.5 million with us, and now you want an extra f- half a million. Yeah, we like an extra 200 units sold, but we only mm. can get this. So, sorry, Coop. I'm a big fan, but you're out. Like, mm. it's not about the, the series. It's about what he agreed upon. Mm. And this is extra half a million. It's an extra risk to their series. I don't <laughs> see... I agree with you completely. And if he signed... So he didn't have a deal for 2023, though, until recently. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. So what's so, going to happen now is it's going to be strain, strain on the relationship. Huge. Exactly. No, no. So, like, is the juice worth... Is exactly. It, like, I'm not saying... I'm I'm sharing... Yeah, yeah, yeah. ...why KTM's... You are, yeah, yeah. You're right. He made a deal. This goes back to yeah, straight yeah. contract, contractor to yeah, contractor. Yeah, yeah. You signed a... So, my old man... So, uh, if he's my, got a two-year deal, then I would I would concede to that argument for sure. If he signed a deal to do this, like, to do, to deliver X, like, if he's a plumber or an electrician, your job is to do X, Y, and Z. His job is pretty simple. You compete 18 Supercrosses, 17 Supercrosses, 12 outdoors, and fucking win. Yeah. Right? Show up to these autograph signings. We pay for your flight. You go to Allen Baker's factory. Is that good for you? We're going to give you a million dollars. Yep, that's good for me. Sweet. Deal signed. Done. Halfway through the year, hey, I wanted this other thing for half a million dollars, and then my factory bike that we've done all this yeah. development is going to travel the world in a box. They're like, nah, nah, nah. Going back to Roger's old. Yeah, yeah. This is new. Old. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. This is new. Yeah. Okay? He, you can't, like, yeah, you can do that when you're done with us. That's fine. Well, no, I want it now. Sorry, you've made a deal. And yeah, my old yeah. man, who I idolize, my dad, always told me when I do my deals when racing, the, everything's negotiable until yeah, yeah, yeah. he signed that line. Then yeah. you got to do the job. Yeah. Hey, I, if, you, if you want more money, you ask for it the, um, before you sign. But once you do that, you do the best job you can. But because the sport's autonomy and because he was supposed to do outdoors this year. Let's, let's mm. role play it. He was supposed to do outdoors this year, right? Yeah. Something was up. <laughs> Cooper don't quit. Something was up. Cooper don't quit. Yeah. Something was up. Like, he wasn't feeling good. Shit's going I on. I actually don't know. I don't either. either. Yeah. I don't either. But so, he just is not a quitter, man. The yeah. kid's the kids a quitter. So they're like, hey, you're not... They gave him some autonomy. They're like, dude, you should just not race. They got We got Dunge to fill your shoes. Let's get you healthy to win. Meanwhile, while he's getting healthy, he's like dude, I can make a half a million dollars. Mm. They're like, we just gave you a whole 12 month or 12 rate, the whole summer break. And now you're wanting more. How mm. much more? Not nah, we're out. We already mm. gave you a, if you would have delivered, if you would have been winning outdoors, outdoors. Yeah. I bet they would be a different story. If you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe. And to listen to the full three-hour podcast, search Gypsy Tales in your favorite podcast platform or click the link in the description below. Gypsy Gang.